Hi, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how I get free articles for my website. And if you watch all the way through, I'll show you some special techniques that aren't readily available or easily found on the internet. I'm Vince from Did You Know Man Institute, and let's get started. do is you don't want to reinvent the wheel when it comes to creating an article. Instead, what I highly suggest everyone do is you go and search for a blog. And um, a lot of these you know, trending blogs within your niche will have content that is already trending or already successful. And it also helps you to create and generate different ideas for your top your niche. Right. So in this case, I'm just going to type in digital marketing for the first step and allow the search engine to find a decent block for me. Now, the very first couple of rows, it's just ignore that. It's all advertisement. But then if you scroll down here, you start seeing blogs related to digital marketing or whatever you typed in. All right? And uh, in this case, let's go with this one right here. Okay, so... This one's quite popular. Right? He's uh, quite famous, and you can check out the content. All right, so let's go with the. Uh, let's see. What's a popular one? Hmm. All right, let's go with this one right here. Okay. So how to do healthcare and medical SEO. All right. And if you scroll down, this is, you know, it's quite a nice blog. I mean, it's very, very long. All right. And it has a lot of, you know, a lot of different, it has a lot of engagement, a lot of different comments. Oops. Let me close this. All right. So that's the second step. Once you find the, you know, once you use the search engine, all right, the blog search engine, and then you type in your your niche or keyword in here, and you found a blog that you like. The second step is to select a, a content or a blog article from uh, a blog post from the the blog that you you selected. All right, now now you're ready for the third step, and the third step, which most people uh, don't really consider, is you highlight the the main title and all the subheadings and you use a second tool this is a, a premium paid tool which i i've tested an ai writing tool which is amazing um, i personally have paid for it all right but you can sign up for free and use it okay so what you can go ahead and do is you can go ahead and write a blog writing section just um, copy the title in here Copy and paste, and just let it write for you. All right, and I'm gonna let it run, and I'll get back to you when it's ready. Okay, that only took a few seconds. Now you have uh, you have a a little bit of an intro right here. Okay. And then now you can go ahead and do the same thing with each subheading. Okay, just go ahead and paste it into here. Click paragraph and let the AI writer create a paragraph or create content for you. All right, and so on and so forth. I'm just going to do a few more so you get the idea. Okay, right here. All right, and if you don't like it, let's say this is a bit too short, you can go ahead, all you have to do is delete it and do it again. And let it work its magic. It does take time and you get something different, okay? Um, and that's, that's, that's basically it. So let's, let's see how readable it is. Uh, how to do healthcare and medical SEO. Developing a content strategy is essential for any website. A content strategy can help you attract new visitors, convert them into customers, and turn them into repeat visitors. 
It can also help you acquire links from websites that are relevant to your website's topic. In this post, we will give a brief introduction on how to do healthcare and medical SEO. We will also mention some of the most important things that should keep it that you should keep in mind when doing SEO for your healthcare or medical website. And then next one is why do healthcare medical professionals Professionals and businesses need to understand SEO. Search engine optimization is the process of influencing the visibility of a website or web page in search engine results. All right, so as you can see, it's very readable and it's logical and it makes sense. And on top of that, you're not you know you're not copying or rewriting any any of this. You're gathering your own uh, content. So basically, you know, rewriting. It's just basically just taking all this and, you know, switching around the words or substituting a few words, maybe changing a sentence, a couple sentences up and then pasting as your own. Google's too smart for that. It's not going to work. Right? They definitely can tell um, whether it's, you know, rewritten or not. But if you do it this way, you still have a yeah, completely unique piece of content but you're just borrowing the bone structure or the skeletal outline of a content that's doing very well. So therefore you've cut back a lot of the work and having to, you know, do the outline and you don't, you basically don't have to create the content because you have uh, this software, this AI software, go ahead and fill it out for you. Right? So you're killing two birds with one stone. It's very, very powerful technique. Uh, I highly recommend it. And it is free. Right? Um, you can you can sign up for a free account. I would highly recommend though that if you're serious about you know getting traffic, uh, creating content, I would highly recommend um, getting a subscription so that you can you can you know bump out these articles because you you need to uh, have a consistent uh, content creation schedule in order to you know build up traffic. And this is definitely the, one of the easiest and cost effective ways of doing it. You can do it for free, like I said earlier, but you know, if you're serious about you know, tr- driving traffic, I would highly recommend those of you who are serious about it to upgrade. I'll leave uh, written instructions on everything I've covered in this video down below. And if you enjoyed this video, could you please hit that like button as it would be greatly appreciated. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Vince from Digital Menace and I'll see you in the next video.